What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I made a bacon evo cheese homemade burger today and I thought I should share because it just tasted so yummy. You need some awesome ground beef. Adding on to that is some turmeric for some color. And next I will be adding some ginger. If there's one thing I must admit I forgot to add is garlic. It is going to make a massive difference. But that's okay. Next I'm adding black pepper. And then I am adding some thyme. If you don't have it you can use any dry herbs. I think it should work but I like mixed herb. I just didn't have it. This did the work. Right, peri peri powder, very important. You need that heat in your patty. Trust me, if you don't have it, just add cayenne pepper or paprika, anything to give you that heat. And then brown sugar. You have to add this because when it's heated, it literally just acts as a marinade, like a sweet marinade. Then this is buttermilk. Because I don't like adding egg, I just don't eat egg, so I just add buttermilk to make sure the mixture comes together. This is the famous six gun spice, which is loved in South Africa. So just use your favorite spice. If you don't have it, then just mix it up. Mix it up. I like using my hand. Okay. It's clean. That's what matters. Okay, so this is what the mixture is looking like. The yellow color is because of the turmeric that I added earlier on. So what I'm doing now, I'm just making meatballs. So you just basically just making round balls using the palms of your hand and we're just going to press it down like this and voila it's a patty just like that easy peasy manazel you know just like that fry up the patty make sure you keep it in for about two minutes on each side because we still want the juice inside and frying next to it is some bacon that we're going to use and some egg that's for my other family members who eat egg because I just don't want it in my burger okay what I have is enough so make sure you add your onion it's going to be worth it that crunched that caramelized sweetness goodness it's going to be worth it so make sure that you add it alrighty just like that -y burger guys smells amazing it is fresh from the bakery so yeah it just it, it's got to be fresh it's got to be fresh I'm adding some vegan mayo for the base please do add mayo it adds that creamy effect my patty is done and I'm going to lay it on my burger so there goes one because two is better than one <laughs> all right so I'm adding some caramelized onion because it just adds so much flavor and crunch and texture to the burger is just unbelievable okay all right yay done I'm gonna add some cheese this is cheddar cheese and it's literally going to melt in seconds because the patty is hot the onions are hot and I'm going to put some hot bacon on it because I can I love my bacon crispy because it gives that crunch in the burger but don't burn it there's like a thin line don't burn it don't do it don't be that guy or don't be that girl okay sweet chili honey be generous with this okay be generous because I'm literally only using two sauces mayo and sweet chili so be generous because we do not want a dry burger some evo you guys know that evo and bacon are like best friends and they have to go together and they make magic and wow like i don't even know what to say this burger was just perfect the combo honey let us pose this model give me your left shoulder turn right smile for me girl turn around There you go. I like that pose. Yes, girl. Mm -mm -mm. Now you better look at that one more time so you can make it yourself at home and enjoy. Thanks for watching, y'all.